Hi right, guys, just an update on the vertical tower. Um, as you can see here, I think I've shown this all last time, but for the new people, these, all the holes down here I've made, you know, using the heat gun. I've put in these 90 mil pieces of pipe all the way down. That's so I can hold these cups inside. So they cup like that on the top side, that's where the holes will be. So during the night, it'll hold water in the bottom corner to keep the plants wet during the night as I'm rolling on solar, running on solar power, so, um, yeah. Now in the top here, I can show you, there's a grate I've put in there. Now, I've used cable ties all the way around, it's all nice and tight in there. The water's gonna pour here, about that angle, through the grate as it turns around. So hopefully it should splash all around, and you can see all the way down. It should, hopefully, pick up all the, the cups all the way down. Um, on the top here, this is what I just made. It's a piece of eight mil threaded rod and I've welded it just here. Now on the outside, to keep it waterproof, I've used shrink wrap. So I just put that straight on, use the heat gun and that um, makes the whole thing waterproof. I put a little bit extra around the, the weld as well. So there you go. So that's what's it's gonna be hanging on, making it turn. Yeah, so that's the top piece in there. Now I'll show you up the back here. We've started, sorry, up the back here, I'll just show you. Here's all our systems here, all running. There's four different systems here, all running well. Everyone's looking really well. And if you look on this side, here's the structure I've put up. That's all concreted in the ground. So they're three meter long. Um, 90 by 45 pine, but treated pine for termites. And up the top I've used 100 mil coach bolts, two on each side in there. And at the top, I don't know if you can see it, there's a bearing up the top there. That bearing, that's a pillow bearing. So it's a 12 mil pillow bearing, which is gonna carry the load. So I'll show you all that next time when I put it all in. Down the bottom, I still gotta move this um, parsley down here clean out and I've got to put the reservoir in the bottom here as well so yeah that's what I'm up to here I'll just show you the reservoir I'm using which is this fella here so this one's got a little double hinge on it I'll just close it up and show you so it's got two hinges on the back it's got two openings on the front so with the lid I'm going to cut through the center here so one side, there'll be a hole cut out. That's where the bottom of the vertical tower is gonna sit in. So this will be all in the ground, except for the lid sticking out. And this side will open up um, to put nutrients and water in. The pump also will be coming through the back corner as well. Yeah, so, there you go. Thanks for watching.